Before school begins in St. Louis City, public schools need help getting students to class. And parents, eight bus routes are being suspended for the first 10 days. Fox 2's Patrick Clark is live to explain why and what parents are going to have to do to get their children to school. Patrick? Yeah, that's right, Mandy and Vic, citing a nationwide shortage, uh, both nationwide and here in St. Louis. Today, the St. Louis Public Schools announcing they are suspending eight schools from their service here on their routing schedule and providing alternate transportation. That's about 3,450 students that are going to be impacted by this. Monday afternoon, a lot full of school buses, but not enough drivers for the city of St. Louis. St. Louis Public Schools transportation partner, Missouri Central Bus Service. The company has been unable to hire, train, and certify enough drivers to handle all the students eligible for transportation in the district. Now, Dr. Kelvin Adams says they will be providing Metrolink bus passes or gas cards for students at Central Visual and Performing Arts, Collegiate School of Medical and Bioscience, Gateway STEM, Roosevelt, Sumner, and Vashon. They also plan to speak directly with parents from elementary school, school students at Betty Wheeler Class School Junior Academy and Malincrot to ensure proper transportation, alternate transportation. This will impact, as we said, about 3,450 students over the first two weeks of the school year. I'm left to take the temporary action of suspending all bus services for eight schools uh, beginning on the first day of school. The anticipation is that for the first two weeks of school, eight schools will not get transportation as they, have historic, as they have historically received. We anticipate our numbers to continue to improve over the coming weeks. Currently, we have 160 drivers on our uh, books. Uh, we're running about 152 routes starting on Monday. Yeah, now high school students will get a bus pass is one of the things they will do that. They're working with Metro on increasing night routes, and they say there are 135 officers they have. They will distribute them and deploy them to the bus services. Uh, Missouri Central Bus Service, is, they claim that they, they are about 65 drivers short, and they are encouraging retirees and moms to consider driving a school bus. You'll make $25 an hour, and their website is driveayellowbus.com. In North St. Louis, Patrick Clark. Fox 2 News.